Heaving huge weights is nothing new for Dave Coleman. He spent most of the last decade building up his strength to throw the discus. Now his aim is to propel a sled down a slope. Dave jumped at the opportunity to give the bobsleigh a go, but admits he's no adrenaline junkie. Terrifying, to be honest. Um, there's, there's nothing you can do or say or anything that will prepare you for, for the G-forces, the speed and uh, timings, breathing, all sorts. Um, but it, it's quite an addictive thing, the adrenaline. Uh, you, you just want to do more and more and go quicker and quicker, so it's, it's good. This time last year, Dave was teaching at Maskell School in Paddock Wood. Now he'll be trying to impress during the upcoming World Cup season. They're always asking after him, how is he getting on? Um, he comes back and visits them quite a lot, which they really, really like. Um, and yeah, but you, like you say, you always think it's somebody else, but then actually we've seen him on Eurosport, we've seen him on TV, and you think, you know, that was my teacher, that's somebody I worked with, um, and somebody that I know. <laughs> Dave isn't the only South East athlete who's made a successful conversion to the bobsleigh. Crawley sprinter Craig Pickering has also made the switch. At national championships we were, we were both competing at the same, same venues and, and same competitions but we never really crossed paths obviously at different events. Um, but now it, it's, a weird, it's a weird situation to be in because it's not an easy like a training partner but he's also a rival we're competing for the same spot sort of thing. So it's, it's a very uh, mentally tough thing to be, to be doing. A few more sessions here and then it's off to the snow and ice and hopefully a place in Sochi in five months' time. Neil Bell, BBC South East Today, Seven Oaks.